Today we're going to do a review of Mo, Mao, Moo. We're not sure how to say it at our house, but it's a fun trick-taking game about trying not to get too many fly-covered cows into your cow shed. Made by Bruno Cathala. We'll show you how to play it and we'll give you our review. There are two versions of Mo that you can buy. There's a standard version that plays 2 to 5, and this version is the deluxe version, plays 2 to 10. And the real difference there is the uh, 2 to 5 version, you just have the green cards and the 2 to 10 version you play the green and yellow cards both. There's also a card here that indicates which direction the play proceeds in. There's some stuff that can change the order of play, you know, clockwise, counterclockwise. The game comes with some pretty good reference cards. It shows you all the cards in the green deck, all the cards in the yellow deck. It also has some like quick rules references that don't require any language. For instance, this would say you have a card 0 6 you can play on the left side 12 to 16 you can play on the right side there are special ability cards and these explain it also if you have a, a a seven cow on top of another cow you can play it on top of a seven this cow is an in-between cow so you can place it between numbers uh, the 16 cow can go at the end get that to focus and the zero cow, it can always go at the beginning. The green deck and the yellow deck have different special ability cards. And uh, there's some yellow ability cards, explains them. Explains them in the rules also. They're, they're not too hard to figure out once you play at a time or two. And also, the uh, two player version is different. When you play the two-player version, you'll start three herds of cows. And player one will play a card here. Player two will play a card there. Player one will play a card here. Player two will play a card here. And you go around and around and around until you bust. And then when you bust, you take the cows into your cow shed. Just continue on around and around and around until you get uh, someone reaches 100 points and it's game over. Or you can play as long as you like. That is a pretty neat way of doing it, having three different uh, lines to play in and trying to judge your cards and when you want to save one for another pile or not. <laughs> Alright, to play Mo, you deal five cards to every player. Scarlet's going to be the start player. She's got the arrow saying we're going clockwise. So first player puts a card down. You're alright, go. You, you. No, no, you. Put a card out. I will let it. Okay, I'll put it out. But you go first. Not that one. You can't play that one. So she put out a nine cow that's got one fly on it, so she draws a card. Whoa, whoa, matching! Ooh, ooh! <laughs> they played a 13. So you either got to play higher or lower. If you have a special card, you can get in the middle. But if you cannot play a card, you have to take the herd, all the cows into your cow shed, and the flies count against you at the end of the game. Got seven red cards are pretty bad. That's three flies on that one. And I got a four. Oh, I forgot to draw. Is it my turn? Yep. You can't play an eight under a four. <laughs> you play less than a four or bigger than a thirteen. Which, isn't thirteen the biggest? Nope. You can play that one. That's the only one you can play. You wanna don't wanna take all those on. So Scarlet's playing a 1, so there's nothing lower than a 1 unless you have a 0 card. Olivia well, had a special card. There's a jumpy cows that get on top of other 7s. So I either have to take all that mess, or I have a special card. And I actually have a special card too. I've got an in-between card. I have a special card too. Now it's back to Merit. And she might be stuck. Yep. Wah, wah. So she takes all these cards into her cow shed. What these? Nope. And then she gets to play a new card. She really? starts another herd out there. Okay, so we keep going round and round like this until uh, the deck runs out. So keep playing Scarlet. There's a nine out there now. Oh, she's got the jumpy cow on top of a nine. So I guess she has to stack that and draw a card. Oh, jump, jumpy. Ooh, Olivia ooh. has a ten. 
Oh. And these are all the cows we've had taken to our sheds throughout the game. We skipped a, a few hands just so you can see how to play. Uh, I've got 11. So I'll do 11. Take a card. Did you drop? Mm -hmm. so Mary's turn. Dad, matching, matching. Mm -hmm. 12. Yeah, nine, Scarlet, nine, your turn. 12. Either higher than a 12 or eight, lower than a 9. Eight, eight, eight. It says 7 to 99 for ages, but Scarlet's 5. She's good to play. She's been playing since she was four. Eight's a good one. It gets rid of a lot of flies. Do you remember to draw cards, Eight, silly? Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Mm. She's got her cards face up, which is no big deal. She doesn't mind a little help. Hey, Dad. And when you Why'd run you out of this, this out of the card, the draw deck. Dad, day, why'd you give this to me? Well, you had to draw one. And uh, once this somebody takes this herd, everything <laughs> in your hand also goes into your cow shed. Uh, junk. I don't have... You get it. Now you have 13. Oh, yeah, sorry. I got 13. And try so, not to have flies in your hand. As now well. somebody's going to take all this and the, the round will be over. Oh, three. What do you got, Scarlet? You have a one or a 14. Look at your green cards. Six. 11. Nope. Scarlet gets all these cows. So that's the end of the round. Cash Everybody adds up all their flies. Even the ones from your hand. I have 5, 10, 15, 16, 18, 19. Put that on a piece of paper. Two. I have 5. 5. Once somebody has 100 Two. flies, it's game over. Six. They're the biggest loser. Eight. Everybody else biggest. wins. It flies on those. This crowd's got quite a few. <laughs> so anyway, uh, Three, four. She's kind of fine. What do you guys, Seven, eight, girls, what do you girls think about eight, the moo, mo now? It sounds really fun. Really, 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 really fun. I what? like how fast it is. Yeah. Not like not the five hour thingies. One, two. It's just a pretty simple trick taking game. You gotta yeah. press your luck. You can either, like if you have a high card, a 16, you can play it first, try to shut somebody down. Or hold on to it later and hopefully you can play it, which you might, they might take the hand first and you get stuck with it later. But all in all, 16, it's a fun, cheap uh, 17, 18, family game. It can be played with anybody. Fun. Got some funny art and good 18, theme. And thank you for watching. Bye. 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 So what's the name of this game, Scarlet? Moo. Moo. How do you girls say it? Brrr.